You plant a seed, if all it knows is what it's been in its life so far, it's just this brown husk that's hard, doesn't do anything, sits there, waits for water. That's all the seed is. When the seed blossoms, all of a sudden like this white little stringy thing comes out of it. You think that looked pretty at, at like the face? What's that hanging off your butt, right? And then one day, poof, this green shoot, all along that was possible. It was inside the seed the whole time. But then one day, whoa, I'm green. And then it goes its whole life like I'm green, I'm green, I'm green, green light for me. Leaf, whoo, different shape of green. I'm green. And then one day, purple. And I smell. It was there the whole time. And if the definition that it had of itself was what it was as a seed and everything that had happened to it before then, would it have ever known the flower? Now it's a buzz in the community. Bees are coming from everywhere wanting to check this thing out. And all it needed was nourishment. It didn't need to change. It didn't need to be anything other than what it was. It just needed nourishment. And the right manure is not the shit you're telling yourself. Got it? This weekend, no one is here to save you, but you. And your job is to use us up so that you can learn to be there for yourself. You got it? Because what's inside, the only one that can nourish that, it's you. That's it. That's it. It's simple. Like there is literally nothing standing between you and what you want. Because your wish is your command, not mine. The mechanics is what he was talking about earlier. The way your body works is the way your body works. You don't have to believe in it, not believe in it. It's not like, this isn't like some cult. You, this is how your body and your mind work. That's it. Simple, easy, piece of cake. When you figure out how to drive the car, you stop running into mailboxes. Like that's how it works, right? People trade addictions all the time. In my case, I didn't trade, I just like, Piled them up, you know, I was like, porn, I'll take a little bit of that, I'll take a little bit of video games, I'll like inhale four bags of chips, and then I'll like walk and talk at the same time and like won't let sit still, and then I can't be by myself, and like when I'm bored, I guess I must be really horrible company for myself, you know? I need someone else. And I would do all these kinds of things. Social media, like get on my phone. How many, how many of you have checked your, your email, closed the app, and immediately opened it back up again? Yeah. This is a compulse. This is the baby looking for something to suck on. There's like legit nothing wrong with you except what you think is wrong with you, right? It's all a mental construct. And that's what makes us sit there and go like, oh, wait, I can't sit with that because that's gross. Let me stimulate my nervous system to wake myself up out of my nightmare. One, of the person, one, pe one person I worked with a while ago used to do like cut themselves. And I was like, why, why, what's going on with that? What's going on with that? Like, tell me about that. And she was like, it's not that I wanted to die. It was just like, I didn't want to feel this thing. And I was like, oh, okay, I'm feeling something totally different. Just take a moment to recognize that all of you, you're all trying to wake up from the nightmare. You're not actually trying to numb yourself. There's an intrinsic knowledge in you that says life is beautiful. I want to wake up to it. 